Hey, what's going on my crazy collectors? This is Local Oaks Collection. So in today's video, we're going to actually do a box opening. I'm over here in my storage unit, have a little bit more space. Um, so right here we have a box from Walmart, another box from Walmart, three boxes from Amazon right here. Uh, this one right here, I actually ordered from a person on Macari. Uh, this one, as you can see, is Target. This one's Funko, and this one is, I bought it from Amazon. Um, so this is actually Rhode Island Comic Con weekend. So I know two of these pops I've been looking forward to getting because I am gonna get them signed, hopefully by Chandler Ring and also uh, Lou Ferrigno. So that kind of gives you a little bit of hint of what those fun co pops that I do have. So let's get into the opening. Okay, so the first box that we're gonna end up opening is gonna be the Amazon one. So we're gonna take a look and see what we have here. Uh, hopefully it is one of the pops that I've been looking forward to getting but then again every pop that I order I always look forward to get so we shall see which one of these is on the list for this one so I ordered just one of these bad boys uh, looks like devil Flanders so we'll see how Mr. Devil Flanders looks I believe it's a glow in the dock, so we'll check out its glow power later on. I'll bring them to my house and uh, take a look. Yeah, so it is a glow in the dock. Um, as you can see, Amazon, I definitely do not like this. That is not nice at all. Oh man, I am heartbroken about that. So I think I'll probably end up returning this. And uh, hopefully we'll be able to get a better Ned Flanders um, vampire. Not really liking that. I'm very shocked. Amazon doesn't do too bad sometimes. So we'll set that off to the side. We're gonna get into this box open right here. So again, this is just the one Star Wars with a pin. Let's see who that is. All right, it's Haunt Hunter. I was gonna say Haunter. It's Hunter. This is not Pokemon. So nice. The box looks in good shape. So I'm happy with that. Amazon exclusive. This is across the galaxy. Uh, Camino, Camino, I know I probably butchered the name, but that's the uh, planet that this guy's from. So I have a few other ones. Doing pretty well with collecting across the galaxy. Some of, the, some of them you'll see I posted in the video. Some of them I don't think I did post in the video. Alright, so we're going to switch it up. We're going to go to this right here, which is the Funko one. Again, I have an idea who this is. And... I'm hoping I get to go see him at Comic Con today so I could actually get his autograph. And you'll see and know what I'm talking about. The show just came out and it is awesome. If you haven't watched it, definitely check it out. Here we go. Look at that. Mr. Johnny Lawrence, Cobra Kai. I'm hoping to get his signature today at Rhode Island Comic Con. So this will definitely be going with us for the ride. That set that off to the side there. I was actually happy that I was able to get him. Uh, it was very nice. Because again, it was very quick that I got him also. And convenient. Uh, Funko actually put him up for sale. And they shipped that out pretty well. So I could uh, get it just in time for Rhode Island Comic Con. Alright, so we don't need that. <coughs> I like how they wrap this up. Alright, here we go. Carl Walking Dead exclusive. This is a bloody one. So he's another person that I'm hoping to get a signature from today once we go to Rhode Island Comic Con. Let's get into this box opening right here. See what we got. Another Amazon. So we got two of them. We already have these him already. Uh, Winter Soldier. Yeah, the shield. 
So I decided to get two more, see if I could either sell it or trade it for something. Get that off to the side. Now we're getting to the Walmart, one of the Walmart ones. The other Walmart one I'll show you. The box looks a little beat up, so I'm not really happy about that. All right. Nice. Hopefully they're in good shape. So this is a Cobra Bat. It's a uh, summer 2021 exclusive. That's nice. That one looks pretty good. Check this one out. Sorry, the camera's moving here. Check this one out. That's actually looking pretty nice. So I think Walmart did it successful with this one. Granted, they didn't have one on top, which very lucky that this didn't get damaged. But nevertheless, we are good. It would have been cool if I could have got the uh, Funko one, like the Comic-Con exclusive one. Not that sheer sticker. But sheer sticker is just as good. All right, let's switch it up. We'll get into the Walmart, I mean, uh, Target one. Let's see what we got here. Oh, yes. These are nice. Star Wars Stormtrooper Prototype Edition. We got two of those. So hopefully we can uh, either trade or, or sell this. Next up is a beat up box from uh, Walmart. So as you can see right here, I'm not really happy about that. So I'm pretty sure some of the fun codes might be damaged based on that so we'll just have to make a trip to Walmart and return it if there is any damage to it. So got a few of these. It's the party floor from what if and as you can see right here that's the damage. And look at that. That is completely terrible. Absolutely terrible. They they really don't care. So that is definitely gonna get returned. Uh, that one's damaged. That one's going to get returned. This one doesn't look too, too bad at all. So I think we might keep him. So we'll set him off to the side. And this is another potty Thor. Which, again, both of those don't look too bad. I don't have the shipping thing, but it's okay. So we'll make a stop over at Walmart and return these two. but if they're in that kind of condition then yes all right so here's the last one right here of the boxes again i bought this from a gentleman on macari and it came just in time again for rhode island comic con and he is definitely on the list of celebrities to get a signature from i like how this person did it they wrapped it very well they put fragile uh, careful opening package a couple times see I like when people do that he did it very securely a lot of bubble wrap on it so this is very nice I'm very happy with that and here we go oh we got something else in there I think this is a box so this was a Marvel collector corpse uh, edition it was uh, Hulk and Bruce Banner. So you got the fun coat, which looks in very good condition. So we're going to set that off to the side. And we have the other contents that came in, which was the squeezable Hulk and the Thor Ragnarok Hulk keychain. So that's good. And yeah, that's it. So uh, again, thank you for watching one of my videos. We're going to head on down to Rhode Island Comic Con. I'm going to see if I can do a little bit of recording there. Uh, All right, so I made it to Rhode Island Comic Con. As you can see, got the bath right there. Go the show. Got some Funko Pops signed. Uh, I wasn't able to get John Carlo because that line was just ridiculously long. But uh, I got Lou Ferrigno as well as Chandler Ring and uh, William from uh, Cobra Kai. So I'm going to showcase those a little bit later. Hopefully we get those graded. Uh, if you can't hear me, I'm going
going to put some subtitles in there, but we'll uh, get on home now. All right, so I made it back from Rhode Island Comic Con. Uh, it was a very good turnout, lots of people there. So despite of everything that's happening with COVID, uh, I did have my mask on. Some people didn't have mask on, but whatever, to each its own. Uh, my goal was to get some autographs. I wanted four autographs from four people. However, I only got three out of the four. Um, the first autograph I got was William, which was also known as Johnny Lawrence from the Karate Kid. Uh, I got that JSA certification there to uh, prove the authentication of the autograph. Um, I got the pop from Funko.com. It came just in time so I can make it here to Comic Con to get it autographed by him. Very cool guy, very down to earth. Uh, the only thing that stinks is I had to wait three hours in line. It was an hour in line itself and then two hours in the uh, overflow line. Uh, when I was actually down in the overflow line, I ran down really quick down to the floor at the Dunkin' Donuts Center and I uh, went to go see Mr. Chandler Ring, as, also known as Carl from Walking Dead. Uh, I got this fun cold pop from Amazon. Again, this one came just in time. I have that JSA right there, that JSA sticker. Got that authentication of uh, approval of the autograph. Uh, it was a Sharpie. It wasn't the pen, state type of pen that I had uh, Mr. Williams signed for his fun cold pop, but you know something? I'll take it. It's a signature from both of them, so I'm very happy with that. The uh, third person that I was able to get an autograph from was Mr. Lou Ferrigno here. Uh, I got this from somebody from Macari. Uh, it was very good. I like it because it's the Hulk and Bruce Banner. So it was both of them. And it was an old school one. And that was from, as I mentioned earlier in the video, from it's an exclusive from Marvel Collector Corps. So I got that as well as uh, got that JSA uh, authentication on there. The fourth person, which I would have loved to get his autograph. However, his line was crazy long um, again I waited three hours for Mr. William to get his autograph I was not about to wait another four hours because his line was very long um, and that's John Carlo um, from the Mandalorian as well as some other shows that he did um, which was Maze Runner and uh, Revolution uh, but I was not able to get his pop sign this was a pop that I was gonna have signed by him However, again, I'm not mad. I got some good autographs from good people. Uh, Mr. William there, great person to talk to. Mr. Chandler Ring, same thing, great person to talk to. Both of them have a very good personality. I met Mr. Lou Ferrigno, the original Incredible Hulk. Uh, he's definitely a good guy too. Uh, good conversations with all three of them. I'm sure if I would've met John Carlo, same experience, hopefully, next time I can get there a little bit earlier and I can hop into his line but again thank you all for watching stay crazy collecting and be safe